Hello and welcome to the Arkansas Weather Blog. We are your ticket to big weather events. It is Friday, October the 12th at about 10.50 uh, in the morning. Fall colors, that's the topic. We have a lot going on in Arkansas weather. And, you know, we're getting to that point now where we really have to pay attention to the weather in terms of how we're going to get these fall colors to turn out this year. And we've been on record saying that we think that it's going to be better this year than in years past, which isn't really saying that much since years past haven't been all that great. But there are things that we are looking at right now. There are pros and there are cons uh, to the leaf changing colors and, and having the maximum effect from Mother Nature. And in my opinion, we have more going for us than against us. And so I put together a list of those pros and cons. First of all, abundant sunlight. Well, we don't have abundant sunlight. Uh, we've had some, yes. Uh, next week after Tuesday, we will. Cool temperatures, check. Ample summer and early fall moisture, check. Dry days, well, not this weekend and into the beginning of next week, but we will. And uh, hopefully we'll get into a drier weather pattern next week, which will help uh, get us to those fall colors. Now, the cons, you don't want a hard freeze. You don't want drought conditions. So again, the hard freeze, we don't have that in the forecast at all, but there could be some frost in northern Arkansas uh, next week. But no hard freeze. Drought conditions, we don't have that. Heavy rain. Now, we will have areas of heavy rain, uh, but the leaves haven't started changing colors yet. We're going to start to dry out later next week. And the one thing you want to watch as those leaves change colors and we get closer to peak and it's impossible to predict, but it's the high winds uh, and the potential with storm systems coming through. If you get a storm system and you get high winds, it can strip the leaves off the trees and it ruins your fall color. So that's impossible to know at this time, but that's one thing that can really wreak havoc with the forecast. All right, I wanna show you the fall colors. And again, uh, this is the, as of October the 12th, uh, how they're progressing from north to south. You see, we obviously we don't have any change, uh, but we have uh, near peak to uh, peak conditions across the Rockies and into the Northern US. This is slowly but surely started easing towards the south. So when can we expect it here? And typically when you look at, yes, it's finally fall. When you look at climatologically when it has been over the past several years, uh, across the Ozarks, the estimated peak is late this month. So we should start to see some colors across the Ozarks soon, but late this month into early November. Across central and western Arkansas, the peak is early to mid-November, and then late November uh, across southern and eastern Arkansas. So, so many factors go into this. I showed you those pros and cons. Nevertheless, chime in. Send us your picture. Send us your video. You go to the KTV News app, uh, or you can go to KTV.com. And you can chime in, just let chime in. You can send us your pictures and we'll be showing them all over social media and on the air. So a lot going on. Um, and I want to thank you so much for using and coming and getting your information to the Arkansas Weather Blog. But there's a lot going on in the weather with several rain chances, including remnant moisture from Sergio heading our way. Uh, so some uh, rainfall, which could add up to several inches across western Arkansas, which is a heavy rain problem. Uh, we definitely uh, want to try to avoid at least. Uh, but it looks like we're going to have periods of rain, not a washout this weekend, but periods of rain. And uh, make sure you're watching Channel 7 News. I still think I've been making the forecast when I update the forecast here. Monday and Tuesday, it may be tough for portions of the state to get out of the 40s all day long. Talking about a chilly no beans forecast, get that, you know, get that carbon monoxide detector. Make sure it's properly working. Smoke detector. Uh, you know, a lot of people are going to be turning on their fireplaces for the first time. So make sure if you haven't had a chim your chimney cleaned and, and you, you burn wood, make sure that, you know, that's taken care of because that's when this is the time of year you, you hear about the stuff happening in the news. So just do those uh, winter preparations around the house, get that furnace checked out. And I, I, what I always say, number one, carbon monoxide. Make sure you have a properly working carbon monoxide detector. You hear of these tragic situations, and uh, let's prevent that from happening. Thank you so much for making the Arkansas Weather Blog what it is. We are your ticket to big weather events.